Hello, this next test is a great test to identify if you have a subscapularis tear. This is called the subscapularis liftoff test. What you do is you take your patient and turn them around. Now there are a couple things you need to remember here. The positioning of the hand goes onto the buttock like that. Then we need to have him lift his hand off of the buttock. Okay, can you do that on your own? No problem. And then I'm going to give a little bit of resistance. So hold against me and don't let me push it. Okay. Most people who have a subscapularis tear are not able to get the hand off of the buttock and sometimes even have a hard time getting their arm in this position. It's very important that you as a practitioner take the patient, put them there, and lift the hand off the buttock to see if they even have that passive range of motion and joint mobility to allow them to get there. Because if they don't have the joint mobility, even if they have good strength, they won't be able to pull that hand off of the buttock. So go ahead and pull your hand off. Good. I like to give a little bit of resistance to see if they have any pain with that, and that's a negative test. Thanks.